Only room for one set of twins on this stage. There can only be two. Okay, sorry. Uh, tonight we wanted to share a little hack that we've learned. Say you get invited to some dinner party and you're worried that you're not going to have anything to talk about. Before you go, just watch a good documentary series on any subject. Yeah, you get great conversation material. The stories are true. They're relatable. Also gives you insight into worlds that maybe you're not used to. And oh, sometimes it's just batshit crazy. Try any one of these nominees for best limited series. Best Limited Series, American Nightmare. To traumatize work, I don't even know if they'll let us go back if we wanted to, because we're the hoaxers. Beckham. That first time that I speak to her, I just fancied her. I just, I just fancied him, and it was as simple as that. Black Twitter, a people's history. Am I a part of like one of those generations that might do something or might like really change stuff? JFK, One Day in America. Her baby, Patrick Bouvier Kennedy, died in August. This was her first visit out of the White House in the public. Ladies First, a story of women in hip hop. Our contributions are often just erased, including their identity. Telemarketers. You wouldn't believe the people they have calling for, like, supposedly good charities. Okay, and the critic's choice is Beckham. Thank you so much for this incredible honor, this award. I am so sorry that I can't be here with you tonight. I wish I was, but I'm stuck with my family in the Arctic. When I was asked to direct this series, I, I didn't know much about the Beckhams, and I wasn't sure actually if I should do it or not because Brand Beckham, underwear, fashion, booze, American soccer, et cetera, et cetera. But once I got to know them, I realized, wow, I was wrong. I mean, this is a love story. It was like operatic, fantastical, and mesmerizing. And boy, could that guy play football or soccer. Luckily, you guys agreed, which I am so grateful for. We needed you guys to take Beckham and us seriously, and thank God you did. I never got nearly as many good reviews during my acting career, unfortunately, but I am still available. Um, I would also really like to thank the Beckhams for trusting me to tell their story, opening up their lives to me. They really had faith and they gave me lots of time and I'm forever grateful. I wanna thank my amazing editor, Michael Hart, my producers who I love, John Batsek, Billy Shepard, Nicola Housen, and everybody who worked on this series because it really was a communal effort. I thank you critics, I thank you everyone for uh, this wonderful award. Forever grateful.